Today's video, we'll be working on this AC. Specifically, we'll be focusing on this insulation that's wrapped around the low side. I've read many articles about the importance of making sure that your low side to your condenser unit is insulated properly. Mostly, the articles all agreed that it affects the efficiency of your system as well as cooling. But the one thing that really surprised me was as I read an article, it was uh, due to a condensing unit in a home that was sent for an inspection. There was an issue as to the efficiency of the system not cooling. And when the inspector did a thorough inspection, he basically advised that the problem was that the line to the condenser was not insulated properly and had begun to rot like this one. Because it wasn't insulated properly, this caused a 10 degree difference in the efficiency of the system in its cooling stage. To the average individual, 10 degrees may not sound of importance, but if you're in this trade and you're dealing with multiple HVAC calls, you will know that 10 degrees makes a significant difference, especially when you're reaching temperatures of 90 and above, even over 100. What we're gonna do is we're gonna remove this insulation. Careful when you're removing it, because you do have your low voltage lines here and you don't want to be too abrasive with it. We're just going to measure the new insulation and then we're going to wrap it around the pipe. Here on this insulation, we have this little tab that we're going to have to pull off. And basically it's a pull and peel and this will allow us, once we remove this tab, to allow it to stick and seal. Make sure when you're wrapping it around that you give it a nice firm grip and as you're working it down just make sure that those two tabs that have the sticky ends that they're sealed together you have it on the next thing you want to do is you want to wrap the pipe at this point it's really up to you as far as how much you want to wrap some people just do the ends a little bit in the middle um, some people like to wrap the whole pipe it really depends on specifically what you want to accomplish um, but at this point you just want to make sure that the insulation itself is set on properly. Now, depending on what environment the AC is gonna be sitting in, if it's on a rooftop, if it's on the side where it's exposed, um, you may wanna wrap the whole pipe because the, the time period that this is gonna be out here over the years, it's gonna to start to get brittle like this. It's gonna to start to break. Um, you can see here that here they only taped it in certain portions and you can see the tape eventually dried out. See here, I am working my way all the way around. And what I'm doing is, obviously I can't take the whole roll and wrap it, so I have to do it in pieces. So I'll wrap a little bit, then I'll cut it, wrap it again, cut it, wrap it again, cut it. And I'll continue to do this process all the way till I get tight here to the exterior of the wall. If the video was a help, if it was informational, please subscribe.